Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today's video is going to be a realistic weekend clean with me. We're going to be switching up my almost four year old Lexa's toddler bed to a full size bed. So I'm just showing you guys the mattresses and box springs we just bought the night before. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I just need to do a quick little tidy in here. And I have the girls eating lunch, and I'm purposely doing this while they're eating lunch so that I can get it done more quickly. Yeah, his baby said that they don't got a future, future like that. It burns. So give him something worse to kill his head with Make him forget somehow Might be that another day She would have wished he stayed with her done Sorry, this won't be enough this time Yeah, he's calling all his friends to get some action And distract him right now He's fine, but Lucy on the line Let's get this started, where's the party tonight? I feel good, nothing weighs me down I can't believe my love So when we purchased these rails, they actually had ended up sending us some that were cracked. And so we had a couple of boxes down in our basement. So we happened to grab one that was cracked. So my husband went downstairs to get the replacement that the company had sent us and swapped that out. And it was gonna take him a minute to kind of sort through what we had downstairs and figure out which ones to grab. So I just took the opportunity to run and clean up these dishes really quickly while he was doing that. A job to pay the rent is busy Gotta feel free sometimes But what doesn't make you Will only make you stronger If you believe what they say Maybe that another day She would have wished he stayed But they're done Red eyes while he shy Don't you wanna have fun? the girls were super excited about this project and so they both had to have a turn to help and literally this was all we had planned for this day other than my last minute pedicure plan so we kind of just took our time with it and let them help us out on this day and they really did have so much fun. Yeah, this baby said that they don't got a future, future like that. It hurts, so given something worse to pass the time. In the morning, you wake me up to have a conversation and inform me about how I make you feel inside. You keep talking and I'm listening, but could you try to shut up? I'm almost getting dizzy now from the way you bum me out. I know that you wanted me to be someone I'm not, give you all my love and never mess it up. But I won't be pretending that I have some in love For you, baby, I'm done, I'm just done Because I'm way too passive-aggressive for you, babe I know that I can't be too fast But I won't feel like you do, babe You know I'm sorry, I shouldn't talk about mistakes It's not like you'll get a retake I 
time I see your happy face, I wanna tell you to just leave me alone. Take a hint, don't be so selfish. I'm trying to make it easy, point you in the right direction. Yeah. Could you stay away from me? Yeah, let's just try turning it on this wall and then see how it looks. I just, it's taking up too much of their play space right here. So we're just gonna move this out the way and try that. Not so much bigger than I was thinking it was gonna be. Yeah. See, that's why originally when I was looking at the other bed, I wanted a bed that had a headboard on this side. but. We couldn't find one. I hate to, I wonder if we should just center it in front of the window. Like I hate to do that too, but I just don't like the way that looks at all. Of well, that's how I feel like it, it's doing now. Yeah, then why would we do the same thing in front of the window? Why would we just do it right there? Oh, man. Yeah. I guess we're just so, I'm just so used to her having so much extra space. Yeah, because I mean, if we put it, even if we moved it up against that wall, it kind of blocked like a foot of the window. Yeah. I guess let's just try putting it back how it is and we'll live with it like that for a few weeks and see. Because originally I was thinking, oh, they have a sheer room that would have the entire thing. I don't know, I guess I thought this was going to be lower and then I feel yeah. like it would make the room more open. I didn't expect this to be so high. Ooh. I really didn't expect Ooh. this to be so high. I was expecting it to be like half this height. Well, then it would have made the room look more open. Oh, this room if off. you get in, then we can't put your box in there. Your mattress. All right, you're going to have to move out the way. Let me bring your, um, your bed in. Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to This is like ridiculous. What is going on here? I don't know why it's so high. We put the bed on the lowest setting. There was one setting lower. You want to try that? Because you were worried it wasn't. Let me try to move it. There's one setting down. We just thought maybe it wasn't a full setting. Let her get on it. She's so anxious. Try it up and then we're going to do one more thing. Tell us how you like it. I'm still washing her new sheets anyway. Go ahead. Help her get up, Daddy. She can't. Oh, she can't. <laughs> She's gonna need a stool to get in her bed. This is crazy. How is that even normal? That can't be normal. Yeah, is the box frame just so thick? I mean, the mattress is pretty thick because it has a pillow top, but I don't think it's that much. Now she's gonna be touching her chandelier all day. Oh, man, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Let's try knocking it down a knot, or see if we even can. We can just put the mattress off to the side and try it. All right, let's see it down, honey. It's still gonna be high, but it, I think it's, I think that's a little too high, honey. So you guys will see in just a moment, but we ended up having to go back to the mattress store. And when my husband went back to the mattress store, they actually told him that he should have been given a smaller box spring, but because we opened the package already, they were not able to swap it out, which is very frustrating because we told them this was for a four-year-old. We had it, we had her with us when we originally bought it, and so they knew it was for a toddler, so I don't know why they would not have offered us the smaller box spring. That just seems a little I thought this, I thought this whole pad was gonna sit up above. Yeah, I did too. Well, first I thought the foot railing was gonna be lower, which I guess is, if the bed sits up that high, it's, uh-huh, that's what I'm doing. Oh. They're in the dryer now. You like it? 
We had to go out and buy new sheets, so they're in the wash right now, but we'll show you guys once we make the bed up what it looks like. We haven't got her comforter set in either. That's, we ordered that. That's going to be here. Actually, the one we wanted was out of stock, so it'll be here in a few weeks. So <laughs> we'll try to get this in, in the same video so you guys can see the before and after. But she's super excited. She's been looking forward to this. It's going to be really hard for her not to jump on this bed. <laughs> It's going to be very, very tempting. <laughs> you excited? How how old are you turning? Mm. Say four. I'm going to be four. Four on my birthday. Yep. yep. And that's part of why you're getting a big girl bed. You're going to be going to pre-K four. Oh, your unicorn definitely fits in this bed, Alexa. So we were about to start uh, making the bed up and we realized that um, there's a hole in the side of the mattress. So he just called them. Luckily, they're only five minutes on the street. They have another one in stock. So he's gonna go swap it out real quick. So while he is doing that, I'm gonna go through and just fold up this laundry really quick. I'm supposed to be meeting a friend later to go get a pedicure together. So I'm just going to fold this up real quick and then hopefully he'll be back and we can get everything put down and I can go on to my pedicure. <laughs> True mom life. You don't always finish a top, like, a task before you have to do something else. Does anyone else's bras get stuck to literally every other article of clothing? Like, why? How? I got this boy on my mind that I can't live without all his eyes I can be. He keeps talking about everything that he likes And I can't stop listening I'm thinking about him all the time I'm thinking about him all the time I'm thinking about him all the time All the time And my heart's beating fast when he's looking like that Oh, his smile is killing me It's the way that he moves and the way that he laughs So I can't get enough I'm thinking about him all the time I can get him off my mind to be mine, to be mine My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah You know I want him now, 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 now My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah I told him I can be a fighter if you want I'll be there to catch you if you fall I can make it brighter when it starts, when it starts I told him I would do it all for you And I know you do it for me too Cause I can get him out of my head I don't care what we do, everything's really new Even if we stay in bed My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah You know I want him na, 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 na My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah I told him I can be a fighter if you want I'll be there to catch you if you fall guys noticed how clean and organized my underwear and, and stuff is now like my socks and bras and all that but that was a project I just recently did and I'm so happy with how it turned out if you guys are interested in watching that I will link that video up for you guys but it all turned out so nice and I've kept it up for about a month now and I'm just loving 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 it and it makes me so inspired to organize more spots in my home
clothes away, which this one just came off the hanger. And then I'm gonna save this one basket of the girls' clothes because my husband should be getting home any minute. And I'm actually already running late to go meet my friend. I had, didn't have these plans before the day started. I just made them, but we didn't know who's gonna have to go back and return the, the mattress. So I'm gonna hang these up. And these couple of clothes, I had a few shirts that I missed of my stuff. Save the girls' stuff for later because I hate to get in the middle of a project and not be able to finish it. I'm gonna hang these up and then I'll be done for this. And I'll either do this this afternoon or probably not until next week. I feel accomplished to get any laundry done during the weekend, <laughs> if I'm completely honest with you guys. Cleaning out this closet is on my list of things to do. Hopefully in the next two weeks I'll get that done and you guys will see that video. I have a plan to get some get some organizational systems in place so hopefully I can keep my closet organized once I get it organized this time. I was telling you guys in some of my other videos about how like if I find a system that works for me where like I can organize it and it's easy to put back together. Oh, almost forgot these hangers. If I can find a system for me that's easy to put in place, like it's easy to just toss everything in. I don't have to like open up a million drawers and all the stuff, then I can usually keep it that way. It's just things that I don't use very often. I can have it inside of like closed containers. And, um, but if it's something I use on a daily basis, it's almost like, I really need a system where I can just roll it up like you saw me do with my socks and underwear or just toss it in by just only having to open a drawer like one little snap thing like not like a whole big you know hard to access kind of situation all right that's just my night shirts I forgot and we'll be done with this for today be checking back in with you guys whenever I am um, putting the bedding and everything on her bed which I'll probably show you guys the, sh the sheets that we got temporarily but like I said her bedding that we bought her um, which she's gonna be really excited about because she doesn't know that's coming was out of stock for like two weeks so we'll have to wait on that so we did get a, a sheet temporarily because we don't have any other full-size beds we never have in our house we had a queen so I guess some of our old queen sheets would have fit on that which I just now thought about that as I was saying it oh well <laughs> we didn't have any full bed sheets so we just went and bought a set for her and I wanted something nice and like soft for her so we bought a um like a the t-shirt material was it called jersey or something like that set from Walmart so it was like 20 196 22 dollars basically um so yeah that'll be something she can use when her other sheets are being washed anyway so that's fine obviously you need more than one set of set of sheets if you can <laughs> we've gone many times with only having one set of sheets but first night in your big girl bed as you guys see here this is the sheets set that i ended up getting her from walmart that was like the jersey's material and it's so nice and soft and she really loves it we ended up canceling the bedding we had originally ordered because it was dinosaur and she's been dinosaur obsessed for over a year now but she started telling us that she wanted sea turtle bedding. <laughs> so we found a really cute uh, sea turtle bedding and we ended up going with a duvet and a duvet cover because the duvet covers are about half the price of a comforter set. And so we figured that every couple of years, if she wants to change things out, we could change them out for like 30 bucks rather than a whole comforter set for like 60 or $80. And so I'm really excited with trying this out and she loves how soft and fluffy it is. She just kept wanting to lay on it. She's so excited to go to bed every night. It's really cute to watch, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know if you guys enjoy like this more vloggy style video, consider subscribing if you're not already and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.